Hey guys, it's Brody here from Pacific Toyota. Just here to give you a quick virtual tour on this lovely Mitsubishi Triton GSR that we've got in stock. So this one here, obviously we do have in stock here with us today. This is one of our pre-owned vehicle yards here. This one at 77 Mulgrave Road. The other one about two kilometers down our main road at 235 Mulgrave Road. Just up the stairs, there's our showroom. Obviously you can see we have Toyota Finance available on all our pre-owned vehicles as well. So if you are looking for a finance quote on the Triton, please let me know. Um, I'm happy to organize one of those for you as well. But without going too much further into us, I'll jump straight into the virtual tour for you. So first of all, just popping underneath the bonnet here. As you can see, all really, really clean underneath here. All nice and tidy under the bonnet too. <clears throat> Chucking that one down. There's a very minor little stone chip just there. That I wanted to point out but otherwise other than a little bit of dirt it's all really clean a couple of little stone chips here but otherwise it's all just a bit of dust over the top there but as you can see no dents or anything like that in the bonnet and nice and clean down this front right hand guard as well again just a bit of dust on there obviously heaps of tread in the all-terrain tire there uh sorry a mud terrain tire for you uh, Maxxis as well, so top quality tyre, no gutter rash or anything like that in the wheel there, and obviously a black alloy wheel in the GSR. Coming through the rest of the front here for you. Again, just a bit of dust and a bit of polish. There's a couple of little stone chips just there, but otherwise all nice and clean. It does have parking sensors in four places on the front bar here. There is just a bit of a scratch just on the front here that I wanted to point out for you. Just so you knew that it was there. Obviously, being a 2020, you're going to expect those sort of little things like that. But otherwise, really, really clean. A couple of tiny little stone chips just there. And another light little stone chip just next to my finger there as well. Obviously, again, heaps of tread on that tyre there. And all nice and clean through that wheel there as well. And the underbody's all nice and tidy for you there. Coming through the windscreen here, as you can see, no chips, cracks, anything like that. 44990 drive away is our drive away price, obviously including all your GST, stamp duty and everything like that. I do apologize, the roof's a little bit dirty, but as you can see, like I said, no dents, anything like that through there. And obviously just has these roof rails at the top here too. Obviously genuine ones as well, so. All nice and clean down this driver's front left door. All nice and tidy, just a couple of little stone chips just there, but Otherwise, no major damage or anything to the door. Through the back door here. All nice and tidy as well. A little stone chip just down the bottom. But otherwise, really, really clean. So, um, I'll just take you through this left-hand side here. All nice and tidy. I'll go a bit further into the interior when I go around the other side. But there's a couple of light little marks just on the inside of that door card there that I wanted to point out. Otherwise, coming through the back of the... Um, the tub here, a couple of, again, just very small little stone chips, but as to be expected on a pre-owned vehicle. Heaps of tread in the wheel there. No gutter rash or anything in that wheel either. All nice and clean, so coming through the rest of the back here. Really, really tidy. As you can see, a really good looking car as well. All right, so it does have one of these top um, tub covers through here, so it's a lockable one as well. So when you press that down, you can um, obviously lift that up bit hard with one hand with the camera but otherwise it is held up by the struts here all nice and clean in here as well all right there's a couple of bit of wear and tear just on the top of the tailgate there that's obviously just from this popping down onto it and locking up through there all right through the rear door all nice and clean obviously you got a gsr badge just there through the rear bar you've got the parking sensors in the back tow bar wiring harness down there all nice and clean coming down the right hand side all nice and clean there's a very tiny little stone chip just there obviously i'm just trying to be as pedantic as i can with this just to make sure you get the exact condition on the car heaps of tread left in that rear right hand tire and that back wheel's all nice and tidy so all four wheels really really clean the underbody's nice and tidy for a four wheel drive and coming back up through here as well, before I go back through the doors, all nice and clean. Obviously a black mirror being a GSR. Through the driver's door, that's all nice and clean. Couple of tiny little stone chips just on the inside of the door. 
that I wanted to point out, but other than a couple of stone chips, the car's in really good condition, no paint damage or anything like that. Jumping in the back right hand side here, all really, really clean. Obviously carpet flooring as it is a GSR, so top of the range in the Tritons, nice clean. Got that orange and black leather in there as well. Obviously a little bit of wear, but nothing too major as you can see. And all nice and clean through the back here as well. Does has your isofix points as you can see there in the back um, back seats here. So if you are going to be fitting any car seats or anything like that in there, um, it's all nice and easy. Just plug and play with them. All right, coming down the driver's door card, nice and clean. Got your window controls in there. Kick card. There's a couple of little marks just on that kick card there. All nice and clean through the driver's side as well. And again, the rest of the seat's all nice and clean. There's a little bit of wear just on that leather, but nothing too major. Again, there's no cracks or anything like that, like no rips or tears. All right, jumping in now, I'll give it a start and we'll uh, go through some of the features in here. So obviously just a push button start. Nice and easy, no engine warning lights or anything like that on there. 46,998 on the kilometers to be exact. Got that little orange stitching in the steering wheel. Steering was really, really clean as well. Just turn that down for a second. All right, now coming down here, you've got that push button start, a couple of safety features. You've got your traction control, lane departure warning, and that collision detection there as well, as well as your mirrors there. Obviously they are auto fold in mirrors as well, so you can fold them in and out just from that button there. Obviously you've got a dash mat on there. I'll give you a quick look underneath there just to have a look at the dash, but it's all really, really clean. All nice and tidy through there. Nice setup in these Tritons as well. So really clean through the nice touchscreen head unit there. So as obviously you can see through there, that's all working and well. Being the GSR, obviously that's them parking sensors now that I've put it in reverse, but yeah, that bit of a 360 camera view there, as well as that reverse camera just there. So, um, and obviously, like I said, you can hear those parking sensors and it tells you what I'm close to, which is obviously that pole there. And obviously put that back in park, that'll turn off. All right, got your air conditioning controls, so just your fan speed, temperatures, and modes through there. Got your rear diff lock, parking sensor button, so like that going off there. Um, while I'm sitting here, I know I'm close to that. If I didn't want to hear that, I just turn that off, but it's nice and easy. You do have blind spot monitoring, so there's little orange lights in your mirrors. A um, couple of USB points, um, obviously heated seats in these Tritons as well. All nice and clean, got that orange stitching down the side as well. Um, nice and tidy through that automatic transmission. Four wheel drive is now just a switch in these. So you go two high, four high and four low through there. Easy as flicking a switch. And then got all your hill descent control and everything through there. A couple of cup holders, your normal handbrake obviously. Um, and your center console through there. So really, really clean in the Triton. And I will uh, I'll just grab the, uh, the service history out for us as well. Give me one second. There we go, all right, I'll check it in for a second while I open this up. All right, so it does have a full service history. Got that first complimentary, then that first service there. Second service, they've done a complimentary service as well, so just an in-between service. Got that 32,000 there as well. And then 46,000. So we've just serviced it. Pacific Heat is our reconditioning center. So has just been serviced and won't be due until 56,000 kilometers. So obviously a full service history. You know it's going to be well maintained um, and ready to go for you. So turning the car off now. I've still got the key in my pocket. So I'll grab that out for you now just so you can see that. Obviously it's just the remote because it's a push button start. So just has the remote there and then the keys to, I think one of them will be to your roof racks and one will be to the hard tornado cover that's lockable, obviously. But that concludes my virtual tour on the lovely GSR Triton. Now, if you do have any questions about the Triton in particular, um, our finance or warranty options, please let me know. I'm happy to help you out where I can. But I hope you enjoyed my virtual tour and I can't wait to hear what you think. Cheers.